Winter solstice is the day with the least amount of daylight. After that though, we'll be gaining seconds and later minutes of daylight all the way up until summer solstice. So that will be hopefully a good change for those who struggle with seasonal depression. We might not see a change right away, but as the days go on, you'll start seeing more daylight and we know that's good for our sleep and wake cycle, for our mood, just overall health. There's lots of different treatments out there to combat seasonal depression. The more common ones or popular ones would be light therapy. So if you're able to, buying a light lamp or, you know, they also call it like a bright light box and basically sitting in front of it 30 to 45 minutes per day, usually in the morning. That helps, you know, regulate your mood and your sleep-wake cycle. Um, you can also combine that with therapy, CBT, Cognitive Behavioral Therapy. Some people choose antidepressants because that, that also helps improve your mood. Other things like vitamin D supplements, we recommend you check with your medical provider to do it in a safe manner. And also things like exercise, you know, that can also help improve or boost your mood. Less daylight changes how much serotonin our body produces and also it impacts how much melatonin our body produces. And that of course impacts how sleepy we feel, tired, fatigued, and our mood, definitely.